Brad Hassel passed a late fitness test to take his place in a forward line that's managed 24 goals this season. The striking partner, Damian Murray, has scored half of them and is without a doubt the most exciting player in the country today. He's currently the leading goal scorer in the Ericsson Cup with 12 goals. At the other end, the pairing of Alex Tobin and Milan Ivanovic continue to be Australia's most likely central defenders for upcoming internationals against Sweden and Japan. Adam Chianta has a torn calf muscle and George Soros a knee injury, so both miss tonight's match. David Barrett will take a more central role alongside Nick Orlich to fill the gap in the centre of defence. Kim Monteliodorus continues to improve his fitness after missing four matches recently. Despite not being at full pace, he scored the winner against the Melbourne Knights and the equaliser against the Morwell Falcons in his last two matches. Chris Trajanowski is the club's top scorer this season. He's managed seven goals so far this year. It'll be Adelaide City who have the kickoff. They'll be playing from right to left. It's very much a late crowd that's come into High Marsh tonight. They've all come with a rush at the end, and it's a very tidy looking stadium when it's three quarters full as it is tonight. But there'll be high expectations of a good match tonight because both of these two sides have done well in front of goal. UTS Olympic have managed 27 goals in their 14 matches and City have managed 24 so certainly they most individuals who know exactly what to do in front of goal the leading lights of course are Damian Murray for Adelaide City with 12 goals and Chris Trajanowski with seven for UTS Olympic the first challenge of the game there Going in on Kim Monteliodorus, who landed very heavily, but he's back on his feet now. Poor free kick, Lozanowski takes it quickly, but Murray through. Well, what an opening this would be if Damian Murray could open the scoring. He's got no support. He had to go on his own. Ball laid into Hassel. Nice ball as well. Lozanowski managed to win the ball, though it was always looking like a defender's. The way that pass was passed across square of the penalty area. Still Lozanowski, nice play from him to hold up. Switch play beautifully too. This is Yates, took it down on chest there, both Murray on the turn! Oh! Tremendous try from Damien Murray. And fortunately for the goalkeeper, it was straight at him. Even under Zoran Matic, the side often didn't put a string of results together until the last quarter of the season. And that's certainly been the case so far under new coach Johnny Perrin. And that's a fine ball through for Trejanowski. Side netting. But again, Olympic show that they have what it takes to unlock this Adelaide City defence. Free kick taken short. Yates straight in. Good cross as well and just over the bar. From Brad Hassel. And a great cross in there by Mark Yates. Some passing in this first half that won't please either coach. And this is looking more promising for Hassel. Lozanowski outside. Goes on his own. And he had every right to as well because there was no one waiting in the centre. Mori peeled away to the left and Hassel just touched it wide for Lozanowski who drilled it into the body of Gibson. The crowd will love this. Milan Ivanovic. Lozanowski's going outside him. Inside is Gibson. Perrin. Forward for Yates down this right-hand side if he can keep it in. Which he does. Near post cross. And another good cross it was too from Mark Yates. But a fine move indeed by Adelaide City. He picked out Murray at the near post. But the striker couldn't get boot on ball and it ran through to Gibson. And while we're watching that replay, the halftime whistle has been blown. Teladira, nice play from him, switching it over to Ivanovic. Amor, free on the left hand side. Chip forward. Hassel. Well, it was sweetly struck indeed. 
by Brad Hassel after a poor defensive header, but it went straight at the goalkeeper. Free kick taken quickly. Armour. Still Armour. Pulled it back while he's there. Across the goal. And Hassel was closing in on Mike Gibson. Just in case the goalkeeper fumbled. But a nice run from Brad Armour. Murray won the ball in the air. And it bounced favourably for the goalkeeper. Tried to switch the ball to the substitute, Bobbe, who now gets a touch. Good cross in. Petkovic missed it. Trajanovski. Oh, quickly taken free kick there by Zakina. Slater's running through. Still Slater. Ivanovic. Lozanovski's in space on the right. Awkward for him, though. That high bouncing ball. And Blagojevic was out quickly. Taken quickly, too. Taladera behind the defence. Pulls it back. So close to the opening goal. Suicide pass for Taladera. Sakinis too quick for him. He comes forward. Tome. Sakinis was obstructed. Tome still. Kajanovski's in the centre. Comes to the near post. Petkovic comes and punches. The final score here at Hyde Marsh then is Adelaide City nil, UTS Olympic nil. And the man of the match selected by Paul Williams was Milan Blagojevic of UTS Olympic, who wins a great digital mobile phone from our good friends at Ericsson. Well done, Milan.